Welcome back, Hot Wheels and Diecast Collectors. I'm continuing to open mainline Hot Wheels to put into my jammers. Uh, so I've got some more to open up. We're starting back with the A's, like this, which is the, uh, the Acura. Um, so let's pull out my first one. I've made my room, opened up my slots. Here we go. This is a 2018 uh, 90 Acura NSX in silver. Right? Plain silver with the five spokes and no front detail, but we do get taillights. So that looks pretty good, of course. And I've also got the red edition from that year. Also five spokes. Do you have the tail lights? No front tampo. But it can go in there with the other versions that I have so far. And then if I flip this around, I've got one spot down here at the bottom for this brand new for 2022 is an Aston Martin Vantage GT3. And this lime green, which is super cool, this is uh, the P case, by the way. So if you're looking for this, you should be able to find it. Right now it is November 2022, so this should be out on the pegs. We've got front detail, we've got some uh, detailing on the hood. No tail lights, but that's okay. Got some side details. But that looks pretty good. I think that's a fun find for an Aston Martin. Continuing with my A's. got Audi and I've got the new for 2019 Audi RS5 coupe there was a white version and then this red version I'll have to go back and look to see if this had come out was there a black version we got headlights we got taillights is there a black version of this already carbon fiber roof I'll have to go look, but that looks good. Look, it's a slightly different color red. And we've got the 17 Audi RS6 Avant. First color was in red when it was introduced in 2019. It came out in blue. Of course, 2018 had that uh, super treasure hunt, right? But this blue is super cool. You get the front detail rear detail PR5s I'll slide that right in there and then I have this kind of out of whack I'm going to move these over because I have two to put in this was 2018 as well 2019 this is, yeah, 2018. The TV series Batmobile came out in this silver with almost ghost flames. You can see the ghost flames. You can see it on the, on the top. Very reminiscent of the Super Treasure Hunt and Zamac that came out a few years ago. We're going to slide that one right in there. And then there was also a black with blue flames that came out. Which also looks really good. I like those flames. I like it when they put flames on there. I'm impressed that they can do that to the Batmobile. 
But there's that. Nothing, no BMWs being added in. I do have a couple bone shakers. So from 2018, there were three versions that came out. There was this dark blue. Like that. Right, I just got, and this is the closed roof version of the bone shaker. And there was this bright red version. And if you were collecting back then, you probably remember there was also this black Toys R Us exclusive version. No number up here meant it was a store exclusive at the time. But if you look at this one, I'm going to try to hold it real still. If you look at this one, I'm going to put another bone shaker right on top. Can you see that it has a bend right here? Like it's not supposed to come down. It's supposed to be like straight. It's supposed to be a straight line. This comes down and then it changes direction. So there's a bend, it like comes down like this and then it goes straight across. And if I looked at the base, and it's kind of hard to see in the blister, like the base is supposed to be flush with the doors and this one, the this one, the, the sides of the car come below the base, so it's been bent. So not only is this Toys R Us exclusive, like hard to find, like is worth a little more than a main line. That one's also got like an error in the manufacturing process. So we're gonna leave that one in the blister and we're gonna move on. With our bees. And I had a, uh, this first version of the Bugatti from 2019. I had one that was kind of play worn. Um, so I'm gonna replace it with this blister pull. So we've got nice, fresh chrome stripe and chrome on the wheels. But that's always nice to have when you've got a fresh one. Uh, also from 2018, I've got the Cadillac ATSV. Was that the ATSV R? There was a black version, was the first one, and then it came out in this red. So I'm going to add this red version. Nothing on top. Headlights are part of the window. We do get front grille. No taillights. But that's okay. We'll slide that one right in there. got from 2018 55 Chevy in yellow with purple flames. It was a pearl yellow. So it is super pretty. If you don't have this one, if you can't see that, it's not really, I don't think the metallic yellow is really showing up on the video, but this one's really nice. No front, no rear, but we do have top and side flames. That's always a car that looks good with flames. Then they even did it in this primer gray with orange flames. And instead of chrome, this one gets blacked out. Some red lip rims. But that primer gray Pretty cool. That will join the collection as well. Blacked out chrome paneling. And I've got a couple. I've got a, deuce, a little moving. Gotta move some of these things around a little bit because I actually have 
two 55 gassers to throw in here. From the pearl and gold uh, series, um, this is one of the ones. There was a whole series of cars that came out. And so this is the pearl white with kind of a copper. So that one's going to live right there. And then we also had this Guster Gasser. one wasn't super popular with this game tie-in that Mattel did so I bet a lot of these got used for customs and that's okay and then I have for right here I have the 63 Chevy Nova 2. I believe this one was a Kroger exclusive. Black with Flames. I could be wrong. Let me know if it was a different exclusive besides Kroger, but I really think that that's what it was. And then I have a couple versions of this Corvette, the 64 Corvette Stingray. This was 2021, I believe, in white. This was a much better rendition of this casting than the previous one that had really squared out um, wheel openings. This one seems like the greenhouse is a little squished, but Pretty good with those black rondels and it was recolored in red with white rondels all right let me switch out some cases all right I've got the 64 Impala in this cool black and white art pattern. With those white rims, white tires, black base, black interior. Mountain looks cool. And then on this side, oh, we got an upside down guy. I've got this 68 Copo Camaro. I believe this is 2020. It came in black for this first one. And then the recolor was in white. Those look pretty cool, kind of simple. I've got this yellow 68 Chevy Nova. I believe this was a Kmart exclusive. The recolor from the purple that was the super treasure hunt, right? And this is that pearl yellow that just doesn't come through on camera that's real pretty. And 
And then I have another 68 Chevy Nova, which is the first color of this white one. In the Gulf Blue. This 70 Chevelle SS Wagon. It's going to go right up there. Which I really dig in this metallic dark gray with the green and yellow flames. Chrome base to get the bumpers. versions of this, the uh, 2010 Pro Stock Camaro in Moon Eyes. The first color was in yellow. And this isn't a casting that I have in my Chromium collection yet. So I'm okay with uh, including these Moon Eyes versions because I think that they're pretty cool. That's going to go, I say, uh-oh. There we go. Will it fit? Does it fit? Here's the black one. Let's see, we might have to move some stuff around. If it doesn't fit very well, we'll find out right here in just a bit, because it, it kind of wants to. And then there was a third color in this glossy gray. It's almost like it's supposed to be primer gray, but it ended up being glossy. All right, let's see if I can get this shut. Just barely fits in there, but it's shut and fitting. this uh, 2018 Copo Camaro SS, which was the second color of this one, which funnily enough, so right here, it says 50th right there. Um, and there were a lot of people who saw that TH in the 50th and thought that they were finding treasure hunts um, it is not a treasure hunt, but then the internet ran away with it. Also right here, I can go ahead and throw in this version of the Chrysler Pacifica, new for 2019, which I thought was pretty cool in the Hot Wheels Racing livery. I thought that this was a pretty bold design for a minivan, to get a minivan, like, to get this in there. I think it's I think it's a cool concept to do something like that. And I've got this Dotson Fair Lady 2000, which I think was a GameStop Kroger Kroger Kroger. Correct me if I'm wrong. 1552 the middle color from those three. We've got two more left. One of which is the custom Datsun 240Z in this cool blue gonna go up there. It's 
still need to see if I have the, I, I should have the white one somewhere. I'll come across it at some point. And I've got the regular version of the Datsun 620. Uh, the regular version of the Super Treasure Hunt for the Datsun 620. Which they added some hood deco for the for the Super and some other side deco, I think. I think it was a little bit different, but this is still a cool version. I'm going to leave a spot right there because I did pick up this five pack, which I'll open in another video. And then I'll put that Datsun five uh, 620 right there. All right. Tell me what you want to see. What's your favorite from this video? Give me a like. Subscribe. And we'll talk to you next time.